Alright, welcome back. We're gonna go out here. And we're just gonna save here quick. down what's wrong can't you hear it her singing it's awful oh my Terrible. oh because i love it sing along with the bard as loudly and off key as you can no <laughs> you're killing us my head is melting i'm leaving before the damage is permanent <laughs> the book is clear work in progress through already extensive chronicle of rise of music styles and not notations from across Faerun. Admin an orderly symbol and black and ink on the page stands out. It is awash in color and mandarin arcs. The script below reads Malkinson by Oma. I hear it and I see it and I know it and I feel it. But I can't write it. Or can I? Dance upon the stars tonight Smile and pain will fade away Words of mine will change No Come. What's the tune you're singing? More like butchering. Don't know why I bother. Are you alright? No. I'm moments away from a grisly death. At the hands of this bloody song. I can't... Nothing fits, you know? Uh, that's creative process for you, Agni, and Agni, and mostly Agni. True. And when you finally perfect a song, there's nothing like it. But when you're stuck, and it's just getting worse, ugh. Uh, can I help finish the song? Hmm. It can't hurt. I have her. I have an extra lute, if you want. Uh, first things first. What's the song about? My teacher, Lihala. She loved dancing. Had two left feet, mind. I remember waking up one night on the road and seeing her. Dancing beneath the stars. A huge smile on her face. Thinking of it now, my heart hurts. And my words just seem to crumble. Like ash. Wait. Words of mine will turn to ash. That's perfect. Keep going. Nah. Keep going. What would you say to your teacher if she were here right now? That... That it's okay. That I'll be okay. And thank you. For everything. Alright, and that's what your lyrics need to say. Mm -hmm. Moon reminds me of your grace All the love I can't repay Wait Turn to ash 
Sorry. That was a beautiful song and worthy of tears. You even got the soul smiling. <laughs> That's the first time I've played since Lihala died. My teacher. She was playing her lute. We didn't hear the gnolls coming. There was so much blood. Uh, I can still smell it. I'm sure your teacher would be proud to see you now. <laughs> She'd yell at me for that clunky verse. And make me play till my fingers were raw. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. Finish the Weeping Dawn. For her. I've a long way to go. But thank you. Uh, I needed this. All right, um, yeah, there was a little uh, space in between here. Um, uh, the dogs ended up barking, uh, and uh, my other half came home from work, so uh, it was really loud in here with his greeting. Um, so you couldn't hear me or the game, so I had to pause it for just a moment here. Alright, lockpick this, would ya? Thank you, sir. Close, close. Normally, I keep whatever mod I have, but let me see that on you. Oh, that puts your outfit perfectly. Okay. I'm okay with that. Let's go venture off over here now. Talking here. Is someone singing? It's beautiful. Um, I never remember if there's anything down here. 
to collect. You guys don't need to follow. I almost forgot to uncrip. That's curious. Good job. Yeah, we'll take that. Back up. All right, let's take care of this. Quick save. Investigate the beach. Such a such a pretty song. Shh, listen. Listen quietly. A sweet melody beckons you. It vibrates with magic. A harpy's charm. Um. That's the only one, huh? Oh, good. yearning suddenly fades as the spell breaks you are free uh, get back it's a trick no no it's just a bit of water I only want to listen just a little closer oh, we're gonna have to save this boy Everything's gonna be fine once I get there. Let's see who was lured. Gail was lured. <laughs> Yes, ma'am. Let's do it. Need to learn the hard way. Get her. Good job, girlfriend. Too far? Job, you. Let's go. Swift and lethal. Come join Carlac here. Let my name be known.
this set. Down you go. The light one? Another day, another fight. I'm heating up. Oh, I don't know if you can make it over here. Oh, you can. Good job, Carla. You get her. I still have my person. Sometimes when these springs come up, you get one of your characters there with. Um, they're gone. Are you alright? No. Yes. I mean, I don't know. Uh, let's see, take a breath, deep and slow. You're safe now. Th that's what the voice <coughs> said. I almost got to the nest, but the singing. I need to get oh, back. Oh, that's great. Mo will be so mad. Wait, um, you should meet Mo. She'll be grateful you helped me. Spell Find a boy called Donny. Tell him you want to see the dragon's lair. You got it, dragon's lair. Oh. I'm gonna be all sticky now with my drink. All right, let's go exploring here. I believe. Never wanted the easy path. Go over here, quick. Yes, we gotta wade in the water. You can do it. No traps, please. Oh, I don't want the bone. Come down here, please. <laughs> All right, so we're jumping. It's fine, Carlac. You don't need to come here. Um, let's see what they're hiding. Let's see what those harpies were hoarding. Let's read first. Miriam, I'm sorry it's been so long since I've written. A lot has happened. First, some good news. Maggie Two Fingers won't be bothering you anymore. I paid her back in full. I'm sorry, she should never have gotten your name in the first place. Now for the bad news. My love, I'm not coming home. Not for a while, at least. The money came from a emergency er, mercenary group. Probably best I don't give their names. And I have to. And I have agreed to a couple of jobs in the, the Icewind Dales in return. They pay me up front because, God, it's so strange to write it, because they needed a warlock. They needed me. I took the deal, the companion, companion, campion offered. I'm not going to say I have no choice because that would be a lie, but I don't regret it. I'm a new man. I feel strong for the first time in my life. Aside from being awoke in the middle of the night by the smell of sulfur, he likes to drop to see how everything is going. I have no complaints. If you don't reply to this letter, I understand. And if you don't want me to come back at all, well, I understand that too. I love you, Miriam. 
And I want you to be happy, even if it's not with me. Edmund. Well, I'm taking everything but that damn bone. Alright. Jump a little. Alright. Group up. Oh, well, now you come over, Carlac. here that's good that's very good come on over mm, I don't see anything okay. missing here okay job here. Let's get this harpy over here. No. <laughs> uh, check the skeleton. You take that. We'll take that. We'll take that. Uh, yeah, no, thank you. And one more. Nope. <coughs> All right, let's head back. And go see the mole. Um, Boy, I mentioned our walks together, aren't you? Gay? Um, sure, in silence. <laughs> You're not fooling anyone. You're very suspicious, aren't you? All right, let's stop and complete this one first. Something to ask. You ever scare me like that again, and I'll feed you to a knoll. Mom, Why are you covered in blood? I'm fine. Huh? Stop it. Our little hellion told us what happened. Thank you. Really, Morgan? Don't know what we'd do without her. No more light finger antics, right, Arabella? Yeah. I mean, thank you for helping me. What were you thinking? She was not thinking there, mother dear. Keepsakes? Nope. Keep forgetting. Valuables or whatnot. Miss Morgans. Come here. One moment, guys. Morgan. Come here, please. Morgan. You be good now. No more barking. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, hopefully that wasn't loud when I was calling her. Alright, let's talk to Donnie. He stares right past you, as if you're invisible. Or boring. <laughs> Donnie, is it? I want to see the dragon's lair. He nods, then reaches for a concealed hatch. Hey, thanks for showing me the door. <laughs> Leave. All right.
Let's talk to everybody, shall we? Let's go talk to him first. You came! I have... Here! Mole said I should thank you properly for the <laughs> harpies. So I wrote you a story. Aren't you a clever one? That's very kind. It's about you. I hope you like it. <laughs> Alright. Uh, books. Uh, this one. Once, we're, once there was a boy on a beach. He saw there was a harpy nest. He was a very good climber. He wanted to climb to the top and steal the harpy's nest. But the harpy was very mean. She sang a song and the boy forgot what he was doing. But then an adventure passed by. The adventure was very strong and killed the harpy in one blow and saved the boy. Well, it took more than one blow and there was more than one harpy, but anyway. That's besides point. Uh, the boy was very cold and scared. He was standing in the water, so he was very cold. But the adventure had saved him. The boy thought the adventure was amazing. The boy wanted to be like the adventure. He wanted to be strong and save his people. <laughs> and never be scared again. Just like the adventure. The end. Cute, sweetie. Cute. I need new pockets to pick. You're blocking my light. Oh, I remember you. You're the one who helped me get away. You want something? Were well, you just here to stare at my forehead? Well, since you mention it, stare at his forehead. Yeah, okay, fine. Very funny. What do you want? Uh, tell me the truth, the adventure's locket, do you have it? Look, if I had it, would I tell you? This entire conversation is a waste of our time, don't you think? Now find yourself a maze and get lost. I'm busy. Quite an attitude you have, a little boy. But I find spunk to be unnecessary. Seems simple enough. When do I get to run the ring scan? Sylphie got caught. We have to lay low for a while. Yeah. I knew she wasn't ready. Can you stop? It's not like you never got caught. Mm -mm. There was once two sisters. One a great fire Versus and one a great cleric here. who longed for a new adventure. I shall scroll the elder brain with my sword, cried the fighter to the underdark. I wish to know the secrets of the brain's power, said the cleric. Let's be off. In the recess of the deep, the sisters slewed darklings and jira, oh, bugbears and blue tits. Now. Blue tits? Yeah. The two reached an Italy colony when the fourth identity passed. Their quest would soon be complete. With great effort, they fell a half a dozen mind flares and soon reached to the elder brain's lair. It rose from the brain pool at the end, uh, at the center of its chamber, flanked by lithids. The brain did not speak aloud, but the sisters could hear it in their minds. I am called Koz, why have you come? I will make your power my own, called the cleric. I will crush you and bring you to the end of your tyranny, said the fighter. The brain hollowed in silence. A moment later, a burst of cyanotic energy took the chamber and the sisters lay dead. Good luck, Koza replied. The Lithas feast hardly that day. Sorry about the nest. Need something? Oh, you were in my way. No. I need new pockets to pick. Junk. Don't worry, kid. In Boulder's gate. You don't look so tough. Mole thought of a hobgoblin all by herself. Oh, that's good. I get to run the ring scan. Sylphie got caught. We have to lay low for a while. I knew she was The book ready. is a center it's argument it's is encapsulated in a chapter devoted to Reza Rael, Guild Kingpin of the Little Com 
Claimshun. In another time and another place, Rosalriel would be celebrated as a revolutionary. In Baldur's Gate, in her own lifetime, she was known as a criminal lord, a kingpin of guild, ruling over the city with a within a city that is distri uh, the district of the little clamshell. Riz's story begins when she was an orphan at a young age. Her father was hung by the flaming fists for sheltering his fugitive brother. Soon after, her mother was denounced by the jealous wife of the Patria and imprisoned in the sea tower where she perished. Alone in the world, she learned two valuable lessons. When the law is corrupt, it is necessary for those without the support of its enforcers to act outside it. And when the law is brutal, it is a lethal duty to act against it. Operating from within the Clam Jewels Imperium, Reza known the val value of everything and everyone that moves through Baldur's Gate. She controls a wide network of agents who observe and track exchange of goods and information as closely as merchants or politicians. But secondhand knowledge is cheap. Rezel real trick is to draw those with secrets to share directly into her orbit. At the Garden of Whispers, information can be shared with the guild anonymously. Anyone with a grudge to bear or in a competitor to bring low that is to say, anyone of importance can ensure that the whole city knows their grievance. It is said that if somebody speaks your weak spot in the garden at dawn, you can expect to find a knife buried in the exact spot before night falls. And yeah, that explains why Mole is the way she is. Oh. Hello again. Hello, dear. Um, Mole's in charge here, not me. All right, Molo, your turn. Well, look who's come to visit. My kids say you've been busy since you got here. I heard you helped Melly with that locket. I owe you for that. Mercon says you got him out of a tight spot with some harpies. Gotta say, I'm impressed. You saved Arabella from the druids. Don't know what those bastards would have done. And thanks for going easy on Sylphie. Not many marks would have done the same. Um, why are you running all these schemes and swindles? Risky, you know. We're saving up for a better hideout when we get to Baldur's Gate. Why? You planning on telling me stealing is wrong? I'm not your mother, do as you please. Didn't need your permission, but fine. Mm, do you have anything to drink? All right, I'll be right back. All right. Anything else? Nope. You've been a friend to us. Come back anytime. All right, let's go in here. Gail. I always forget about these. Give me a moment here. F3. Mm -hmm. Let's see here. See how those feel. Let's slap that one in there. And that one. And that one. That one and that one. Okay. And we do want this here. Alright. Let's see what we got here. Don't need that. Don't need that. I don't need that. Um split. Let's do two. Good. Split.
what? You're going to need an extra one, huh? Alright. Alright, that should be good for now. Spell book. Nothing for him to learn. Okay. So he must not be leveled enough to do that. At least things have stayed interesting. Okay. Now we're gonna go back out, I believe. Need to find a way forward. Um, I think it's on this side. Come back this way. And I believe I searched that area before, there was really nothing there. Here goes nothing. So we'll go ahead and end this episode and we'll see you in the next one.